All right, Fresh, just curious about the end of the decision to come here and how's it going so far? How do you like Buffalo? Man, I love it. I love it. I feel like it's the best decision I made, honestly. So it was a well thought out process, you know, between my mom, dad, uh, family, you know, but I'm glad to be here, honestly. And we have great coaches, like every, every position has great coaches and all of them pour into the players. So that's why I really like, I feel like it's a family here and they embraced me as soon as I came in. You know, it was it, it was kind of tough. It was like a little culture shock once again, you know, going to a new school, but I feel like they embraced me uh, very well and I'm just grateful for it. Can you describe your style of play, just what you bring to the field, what you know about as a player? Um, I'm always bring energy. Um, I'm always bring that aggression and, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a team player. And, you know, I like, I like to, I like to have fun on the field too. You know, I like to bring all the dudes around me and, you know, I wanted to spread my versatility as well. So me being able to play in multiple, multiple spots on the field, I feel like that's what, that's what can separate me and help me become one of the top defenders. And the guys are saying how you've already become a leader even though you just got here, just what's it like to kind of step in? How do you balance being a leader versus being a new guy? How do you kind of go about that? Um, I mean, you know, it, it's kind of hard, but you know, heavy is the head that wears the crown. So, you know, it's, it's a lot of things that you have to juggle, but you know, I, I always grew up in an environment where I had to become a leader or I had to do things that was required of me that, that, that was very demanding. So it, it wasn't that much of a difference when I got here. You know, it's something that I was used to, you know, and I, I always say I'm, I'm built for this. So I was, I was grateful to be in that position and I already know what being a leader entails. Uh, there's a lot of hype around this offense this year, but what have you seen on you know, your side of the ball this year that, that maybe people don't know or, or don't expect from this defense this year? Um, honestly, you know, outside the defense, you know, we're, we're just going to stay humble and keep our head down and keep grinding. You know what I mean? Uh, we, we have to have that dog mentality every day. And, you know, it, it's fine for people counting us out because at the end of the day, we have to prove ourselves right and believe in us. Um, coach Alf is obviously a defensive minded coach. Um, how nice is it to be, you know, playing for him? And, and what have you seen from him so far that, that kind of allows you guys to, to be yourself? I mean, he's, he's a wizard. I mean, <laughs> honestly, uh, he's a genius. And even my coach, Coach Turn, uh, Coach, uh, coach Tim, all, all of the coaches that we have on the defensive side, all of them are, are smart. You know, they know the whole defense in and out. And every single question that we have, you know, they have an answer to it. And me personally, I, I like to ask a lot of questions. I like to know the why behind everything. And I feel like they do a great job of elaborating that. So, you know, just, just going back to Coach Half, though, I, I feel like he, he's a great coach and he's a great compliment to, to what I do on the field. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Jay. Thanks, Jay. Yeah, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Yeah.